How we going? What are we doing on episode? It's sort of, uh, what, 10 to 11, so it's a bit late for me, but, um, yeah, you just sort of do have a lot, sort of like a lunchtime afternoon session. Um, yeah, I'm my, on my local water again, Lake Macquarie. So, um, have a quick flick around, see what we can get, eh? Stay tuned. Be throwing around the usual plastics, hard bodies, some vibes, maybe some, yeah, some metal blades as well. Pick up flathead, broom, whiting, jewies if they're around, whatever. But um, yeah, stay tuned, see what we can do, eh? Got a fish, we have a fish. Got the cranker on, vibe. So I'm assuming it's a brimbo. He had a couple of goes out to be honest. Big swirl. As you can see, the water's really dirty. This feels like there's a bit of weight there, so. Which is good. Oh yeah, she's a, she's a beauty. Absolute cracker. There we go. Like I said, I got on that cranker vibe. What size of this? It's a fat one. Look how wide it is. Oh, I'm getting into this sunny. Look at look at the height there. The girth in it. Absolute beauty. Gotta be happy with that. I reckon you should be close to a kilo, you know. Yeah, it's a solid 30, 38. Uh, 1.17 kilos. So not a bad fish. Another look before we chuck her away. Chuck her back. Very high on the, very high up on the water. I'm not sure what I got here. Might be a brim. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it sort of must have took it on the drop and then came right to the surface, eh? Hey? I've only just pinned him, I think. Oh, no. He's pretty well hooked. 
Again, I got him on that um, crank cranker vibe. Starting to be one of my <laughs> one of my favourites. But it the cranker vibe dives down a, a bit deeper. So I'm sort of fishing a little bit deeper. Starting to find that um you know as the water's getting a little bit colder. Um it's sitting a little bit deeper. There we go. Not as big as the other one we caught. But definitely a legal fish, probably I don't know. Maybe touching 30. Should be legal, eh? Yeah, pretty much just touching 30. Yeah, 0.44. So 440 grams. Lock that into number two. The two fish is 1.61 kilos. So we'll chuck her back. See you, mate. Got that on the drop. Wow. Definitely another brim, I think. But yeah, <laughs> I'll let that drop to the bottom and. wound in and it was on there. It's probably around that 30 centimeter again. Oh, I've only just got him. I've only just got him. Ah. Not overly big. I just replaced the uh, treble on it with treble hook. And yeah, I'm glad I did. Probably going to be around the same weight as that second one, I reckon. In the 400s, maybe. Yeah. 0.47, so 470 grams. Lock that into the third fish. And for three fish, 2.08. So we break the two kilo mark, which is great. Um, I'm hoping there's some other fish around here. We'll, um, we'll keep hunting them down, eh? Chuck her back. See you, champ. Got another one, guys. It might be an upgrade, actually. There we go. Not too bad. Might be an upgrade. Got him on the um, plane prawn. Yeah, it's about 30, 32 to the tip. Uh, 
now puts us up to 2.17. So 2.17 kilos total now. See you, champion. He's a bit hesitant at taking it. You know, getting it in the end, but not the brim. Might be an upgrade. Don't know. Forty-seven. We've got to beat forty-seven. So. 470 grams, we've got to beat that. I think we might, you know. Yeah, 0.57. So, 0.58. So, we'll lock that in. And we'll get rid of number three on the here, which was 0.47. We'll get rid of that. And for three fish now, it's 2.28. So that's not too bad. Quite happy with that. We'll let it go. See ya, mate. Whoa. That's a great hit. Absolute great hit. Half decent this one. Half decent brim here. That's for sure. I'll just move out of here if I can. Absolutely crunch that one. He did. That's a cracker brim. Absolute cracker. I've got that brim prawn on. Oh, sorry, clone prawn. Not the brim prawn, clone prawn. You didn't miss that. Come here, mate. Show everyone at home. Come on. Oh, yes. Oh, wow. That might even beat, might even beat the biggest one I've got in there, I think. Look at the size of this thing. You've got to be kidding me. Right on that clone prawn. Look at the size of that. It's definitely a high, high 30, if not touching 40, but Crunched it, though. <laughs> Absolutely crunched it. So we've got to be um, 0.53, which will smash, I reckon. Not as big as that big one we got in there, but it's a definite it's a kilo fish, 1.06. So yeah. Over one kilo, which is great. Um 1.06. We'll lock that in. And we'll get rid of the five five hundred and thirty gram. That one. And we had two two point eight one kilos. So that's that's pretty good. I'm really happy with that. So one last look at that beauty. I thought it was gonna go bigger than the other one, but I think that real big one I got was really wide. 
and tall and fat, but that's still a beautiful fish. Well, the length of it's pretty good. Let's, let's see the length of it. It's like a 39. So 39 to the tip. So we'll chuck it away, chuck it back. See you, mate. <laughs> okay, that's the day over. Wasn't too bad, really. The time's now three o'clock, so I was on the water for like, I don't know, four, four and a half hours. Um, yeah, wasn't too bad. Got some really nice brim today. I think it was a 38 and a 39, and the other one was, you know, a couple in the low 30, so had a great day. Um, yeah, the plane prawn was a, a standout lure again, and the um, crank vibe, the cranker vibe, which was a, a standout as well. Got me biggest fish on that one, to be honest. Uh, Ended up getting uh, nearly nearly three kilo. It was like two point eight one or something. I can't remember, but it was something like two point eight one. I think it was so. That's pretty good for three three fish. I'd be happy with that in a comp day, that's for sure. But I've had enough for a day. I'm gonna head on home. Um, hope you've enjoyed. Um, yeah, leave a comment below. Um, give us a thumbs up. Share the content if you like. Um, yeah, and I'll get you on the water again next time, eh? Tight lines. <laughs>